Hey guys, welcome to Wrestling Days and welcome to some fantastically huge, exciting news. Uh, CM Punk has been offered one million dollars to step back inside a wrestling ring. Now sadly this is not a WWE wrestling ring, this is actually an indie promotion wrestling ring. This is an indie promotion based here in the UK. They're called Five Star Wrestling. They're a very, very big promotion. They're not small fish at all. Um, but you know, it's a very competitive world here in the UK in particular in the uh, indie wrestling scene. I mean, at the time of recording this right now, less than two miles from where I am, uh, Tyler Bates, Pete Dunn, Trent Seven, Jimmy Havoc, I mean, the list goes on. They're all in an indie show performing right now, uh, which I was really debating about going to, but I've decided to do this instead. Um, because, yeah, it's just, this is massive, massive news. You know, Five Star have come out and said that they've wanted CM Punk since, well, well forever, of course, but really since, like, 2015, they were doing a show in Edinburgh. And they've tried to get hold of him. They can't get through to him. Obviously, he was focused on his UFC career. Now, his UFC career, I'm not sure if you can say it's over, but that first fight didn't go to plan. Uh, and uh, I think it was it 2 minutes 14, uh, Mickey Gall picked up the win. And, you know, it doesn't look likely he's going to get a second fight. UFC won't make the same amount of money for a second fight as they did for that first fight, you know, that first fight, it, it had the intrigue, you didn't know if he was gonna, you know, what was he gonna bring to the octagon, and, you know, what he did bring, sadly, was, I don't wanna say disappointing, but it didn't go to plan. So, you know, Five Star have come in and said, look, whatever you're doing with MMA, whatever you're doing with UFC, that's fine, we're not gonna get in the way, we just want you for this event, it's a 128 man a tournament that's going to take place over 30 weeks. I think it starts on June the 10th in Liverpool and they they want him a part of that. Now I'd imagine this means that he's going to work the majority of those shows. If you're going to pay someone a million dollars, you're going to want them you're going to want to get your money's worth, aren't you? <laughs> you know, even if he's not competing, you bring him out at the end for a little bit of a wave. Uh but yeah, you know, so I'd imagine it'd be a pretty full-on schedule. He's probably going to need to have quite a chunk of time free. But the thing is that I don't. I think he's got a few projects going on at the moment. I don't think he is free. I don't know if they're going to be able to make this work. You know, I mean, June tenth. That's like tomorrow. Not really, but you know what I'm saying. Unless you're watching this on June 9th and then it is tomorrow. But uh, <laughs> but yeah, I I don't. I think this one might pass by. I think he might have to turn this one down largely due, due to scheduling, but I think that his passion for wrestling has never been in doubt. I think that he will, I think he will accept an offer to step back into a wrestling ring and maybe he can use this as an opportunity to say that. Just like, I'm really sorry due to scheduling, I can't do it, but I would be interested. You'll have You'll you'll have you'll have so many offers. <laughs> I mean, the world will come calling. Uh, I'm amazed that WWE haven't come calling. You know, I mean, there's business and there's business, and there's money to be made. There's money on the table, but that money is not there forever. It won't be there in say ten years' time. Maybe it will. Ten years, fifteen, twenty. No, you know, he's he's not going to be able to deliver what he can deliver now, and that is a very good competitive match. I mean, look at the decline in, in The Undertaker just over the past five years or so. Not even that. You know, he's uh, this This really is a big opportunity for CM Punk. Um, it's a huge opportunity for us because as wrestling fans, as CM Punk fans, this, this, is, this is the closest we've probably been to seeing the man step in to a wrestling ring again. Um, the fact that it could happen here in the UK is mental, <laughs> but in a fantastic way. I'm proper pumped for it. And, uh, you know, if any of my friends, I don't have any, but if I did uh, have any friends over at Five Star Wrestling, if, they, you know, if this, if this does come off and you want to show me some love, then, uh, you know, the, and the channel and, and everything, you, you know where I am. 
So that's it guys, massive news. I had to share this with you because this story could just keep going. You know, CM Punk might publicly uh, come out and respond to the news. He could accept and then it could all be on. He might have to turn it down, but then another offer might come forward or who, who knows, honestly, who knows? But man, anything involving CM Punk and a wrestling ring has got to be worthy of talking about. And so I wanted to get this video out there for you guys. So let me know your thoughts. If you like the news, if you like the video, then please let me know by giving the video a like. Leave your comments below. I wanna know what you think on all of this. Um, and uh, don't forget, hit the subscribe if you haven't already. So hopefully I'll see you again next time. Bye for now.